In the last few years, scientists have been conducting a lot of research to find an alternative to lithium-ion batteries. We've had some breakthroughs like Toyota's solid-state batteries, which promise a range of more than 720 miles. However, this technology still has some shortcomings. Now, though, Chinese scientists have come up with another type of battery technology, and they believe this battery will solve all the problems associated with lithium-ion batteries. Join us as we take a look at this new aqueous zinc-ion battery developed by Chinese scientists. Lithium is a metal that has many potential applications for reducing our dependence on fossil fuels. It is the lightest metal on Earth, and it can store a lot of energy in a small space. That is why it is widely used in electric devices, such as mobile phones, laptops, cars, and even airplanes. However, lithium is not a perfect solution. It has some drawbacks and challenges that need to be addressed. One of them is the environmental impact of lithium mining. Lithium is not very abundant in nature, and it is usually found in salt flats or brine pools in dry regions. Extracting lithium from these sources requires a lot of water, which can affect the availability and quality of water for local communities and ecosystems. For example, in Chile's Salar de Atacama, which is one of the largest sources of lithium in the world. Mining activities use 65% of the region's water, causing conflicts with farmers and indigenous people who rely on the water for their livelihoods. Another challenge is the carbon footprint of lithium production. Lithium mining and processing use a lot of energy, which often comes from fossil fuels. According to one study, producing one ton of lithium emits 15 tons of carbon dioxide, which contributes to global warming and climate change. This means that lithium batteries are not completely clean or green, as they still depend on non-renewable energy sources. Lithium mining can also cause other environmental problems, such as land degradation, pollution, and biodiversity loss. For instance, in Tibet, a toxic chemical leaked from a lithium mine into the Lichi River, killing fish and livestock downstream. In Australia, lithium mining has been linked to impacts on fish as far as 150 miles away. Lithium production is also associated with human rights violations, such as forced labor, child labor, and violence against local communities. So, it is clear that while lithium has many benefits, it also has many disadvantages and risks. Therefore, it is important to find better alternatives. And this is what a research team at the Hefei Institutes of Physical Science, HEFIPS, of the Chinese Academy of Sciences, CAS, has done. Led by Prefren Zhao Bangchuan, they have developed a high-performance aqueous zinc-ion battery with an ultra-long cycle lifespan in a weak magnetic field. Aqueous zinc-ion batteries have emerged as a promising and cost-effective substitute for widely used lithium-ion batteries. These zinc-ion batteries are particularly attractive due to their potential for high theoretical capacity and enhanced safety, offering a more secure option for energy storage. However, there have been challenges to overcome in realizing their full potential. One such challenge has been the electrochemical performance of the cathode material. The cathode plays a crucial role in how well a battery can store and release energy. In the case of aqueous zinc ion batteries, the cathode's performance has been a limiting factor in achieving higher energy density and longer cycle life. Another issue that the researchers tackled is the growth of zinc dendrites on the battery's anode. These tiny branching structures can form during the battery's charging and discharging cycles. Over time, the growth of these dendrites can negatively impact the battery's performance and potentially lead to safety concerns. Suppressing the formation of zinc dendrites has been a crucial aspect of advancing aqueous zinc ion battery technology. To address these issues, the researchers came up with a clever solution. They used a process called a one-step hydrothermal method with in-situ electrochemical defect engineering to create a special material called VS2. This material had a unique quality. It was filled with tiny imperfections that actually helped the battery work better. These imperfections reduced the interaction between certain parts of the battery, making it easier for the battery to charge and discharge energy quickly. The VS2 material didn't just help with the energy storage problem. It also played a crucial role in addressing the issue of zinc dendrite growth. Imagine you're gardening and you want to prevent unwanted plants from taking over. The researchers essentially introduced a weak magnetic field around the battery, which acted like a barrier, preventing the troublesome zinc dendrites from growing. 
this made the battery much more durable and able to withstand a lot more charging and discharging cycles. The results were impressive. The improved battery, known as the Zen VS2 battery, not only showed an ultra-long cycle lifespan, meaning it could be charged and discharged many, many times without wearing out, but it also delivered high amounts of energy and power. This is fantastic news for the world of energy storage technology. In fact, the implications of this work are quite significant. Imagine a world where our devices can hold more energy, charge faster, and last longer on a single charge. Think about the impact this could have on renewable energy sources like solar and wind, where efficient and long-lasting energy storage is a critical component. Moreover, this research brings us one step closer to the possibility of more powerful and enduring electric vehicles, helping us transition to a cleaner and more sustainable transportation future. So how exactly are these aqueous zinc-ion batteries better than lithium-ion batteries? Aqueous zinc-ion batteries have several advantages over conventional lithium-ion batteries, which are widely used in various electronic devices and electric vehicles. One of the main advantages of aqueous zinc-ion batteries is their lower cost, which stems from two factors, the abundance of zinc and the use of water-based electrolytes. Zinc is one of the most common elements on Earth, and it is much cheaper than lithium, which is relatively scarce and has a high demand. According to the U.S. Geological Survey, the average price of zinc in 2020 was $2,266 per metric ton, while the average price of lithium was $8,500 per metric ton. Therefore, using zinc as the anode material can significantly reduce the cost of the battery. Water-based electrolytes are also less expensive than organic solvents, which are typically used in lithium-ion batteries. Organic solvents are flammable, toxic, and volatile, and they require special handling and packaging to ensure safety and stability. Water, on the other hand, is non-flammable, non-toxic, and readily available, and it can be easily mixed with various salts to form electrolytes. Moreover, water-based electrolytes have a higher ionic conductivity than organic solvents, which means they can facilitate faster charging and discharging of the battery. Another advantage of aqueous zinc-ion batteries is their higher safety than lithium-ion batteries. This is mainly due to the use of water as the electrolyte instead of organic solvents. Water is non-flammable and non-explosive under normal conditions, while organic solvents can catch fire or explode when exposed to high temperatures or external shocks. This makes aqueous zinc-ion batteries less prone to thermal runaway or short-circuiting than lithium-ion batteries. Zinc is also less reactive than lithium in terms of electrochemical potential. Lithium has a very negative electrochemical potential, which means it can easily react with water or oxygen to form lithium hydroxide, LiOH, or lithium oxide, Li2O. These reactions can consume lithium ions and reduce the capacity of the battery. They can also generate heat and gas, which can cause swelling, leakage, or rupture of the battery. Zinc, on the other hand, has a less negative electrochemical potential, which means it is more stable and less likely to react with water or oxygen. This can preserve the zinc ions and prevent overheating or gas evolution of the battery. In terms of applications, aqueous zinc ion batteries are suitable for various applications that require low-cost, safe, and high-capacity energy storage systems. Some examples of these applications are grid-scale energy storage, wearable devices, and electric vehicles. However, they need to overcome the challenges of improving the performance and durability of the cathode and anode materials. So in the end, the breakthrough achieved by the Chinese Academy of Sciences in developing the high-performance aqueous zinc-ion battery and mitigating the challenges associated with cathode materials and zinc dendrite growth could herald a transformative shift in how we store and manage energy. In a world increasingly reliant on portable electronic devices, electric vehicles, and renewable energy sources, the implications of this invention will be very revolutionary. What do you think about this? Let us know down in the comments section.